my goodness. Bro, I got this, bro. I don't want to be my brother. Yeah, Jimmy, bro. We're going to look up at this top camera. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Another beautiful day here in Chicago at the hotel right now. Um, just about to grab some breakfast. The other gang still sleeping. Hey, look at this magnificent hotel. This is the just the waiting area for the uh, for the elevator. I mean, look at this. You can sit if you want while you're waiting for the uh, elevator if you want. Or you can walk around if you want. Whatever works for you. Anyway, I'm gonna quickly go grab uh, breakfast while the other guys are still sleeping. I don't know why they're sleeping, but usually you don't sleep on vacations, right? So, um, yeah, let's go. I'm gonna go figure out where the breakfast place is located. I don't know exactly where, and uh, I'll go from there. So finally the gang has decided to wake up. We're here at the uh, Millennial Park. I was actually down here this summer um, and then now I'm the uh, tour guide for, for, for these fellas. What do you think about the park, man? What do you think about this place? It's amazing, but he has us walking in the cold. But it is a beautiful scene. It's, it's definitely worth walking in the cold. It's, 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 it's definitely worth it, you know what I mean? It's yeah. not really bad, it's not snowing, you know what I mean? It's yeah. about like, what is it, close to 40 degree here? Yeah. Uh, this is where Obama gave his speech back in 2008 when he won the presidency. Uh, so it, it's a very beautiful park. In the summertime they play music here and then a lot of people come over here. It's called the Millennial Park. Um, so this is one of the best, best park in, in Chicago. And check it um, out, y'all. That's the speakers he's talking about. Yep, all those, all those black dots you see right on that, uh, those metal things on top, all of, all of them are speakers. And then and they play music and stuff. So. And then the scenery right behind is the downtown view. Yep, all these sky skyscraper buildings behind you. So if you ever come to Chicago, this is must uh, stop location. You have to come over here. So, all right, now we are the uh, beautiful uh, the Cloud Gate. This is what it's called, the Cloud Gate. It's literally the Millennial Park. The park we just had a little bit ago is right there. And this is the uh, Millennial Park, so it's magnificent. They're, they're all so close to each other, um, and, and it's, it's it's one of the famous um, things that, that you have to see when you come here. About this beautiful building ahead of us. Oh, that's my president building, man. What you talking about, that's man? That's the president's building. Yeah, that's the president's building, that's whether the... you like it or not. You gotta respect the man. Hell man. yeah. Hell. So what did you say? Where are you going again, sir? I'm about to go visit my president. You gonna go visit the president? Look at that beautiful building right there. I think he might not be in that building today, man. I think he might be in Washington, man. But you oh, never know. Man. You never know. That's okay. That's you okay. You gotta, you gotta dress. You gotta you dress. Know? I, I gotta support him. I gotta support him. Okay. All right. All him right. and the horrible things that he's doing to this country. Okay. <laughs> Where are we going, man? 
we're going to a uh, Sirius Tower. Sirius Tower. I think they just changed to uh, Sky Deck. Visit Donald Trump's building first. You want to go see him? You want to say hi to him? You're gonna say hi to the building? Okay. Like like I was telling the other guy, man, he might not be in there, so he might be in Washington today. But hey, you never know. Let's go inside. Though. See if he's inside. Okay. All right. Let's go see him. times we got lost man a couple times <laughs> we got lost multiple times and we finally found oh, no. the sky dock about to get in here hopefully hopefully the window don't broke man and then if you if the window breaks you know what happens man no uh, no 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 parachute for you man <laughs> this, is the, this is my first time actually going to this building I've always wanted to do it last time when I came just didn't have enough time to go now that I came with this group it will be a uh, fun fun time to go in and, and go explore and see the whole city 360 degree view. One more, one more, one more, one more. You gonna do it, Eddie? Yeah. Uh. done uh, from the top now we're downstairs what do you guys thought on that it was amazing day? it was amazing I loved it every you loved bit it? of it what did you love the most man well here's the thing I loved how the kind was so scared <laughs> and he thought it was about to fall off the building <laughs> <laughs> and anything uh, and, and anything the guy uh, to your defense, it's 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 great to have our customer service guy here. Yes, he was helping everybody. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> he, Amazing. He was kind. He, he was making sure was, I was comfortable. Yes, I wasn't jumping out he of the bridge. He was shaking. Uh, had to calm him down. He had to hold my hand for a little bit. It's but, all right. But hey, that's what the customer <laughs> service do. They gotta make sure clients are happy. He was good with that. <laughs> Anything, big guy? Sorry. That was good experience. <laughs> All you gotta say is that I just enjoyed my time out there. We had a good time. Yep. We you, enjoyed we being got, on the sky deck. Will you guys come back uh, next time for this? Oh, for sure, for sure. You heard the group, man. You heard the guys, the group here. Great experience also. So highly, highly recommend it. If you ever come to Chicago, you really need at least like a week to uh, two weeks uh, to pretty much see everything this, this city has to offer. There's just so many different activities so many different things that, that you uh, get to do here but but right now it's the dinner time the the, the the gang is getting a little bit hungry and uh, we need some food so this place is called Nando's Nando's heard it had a lot of good reviews one of the guys here likes this place so we're gonna check it out and see what kind of food they have hey guys welcome back um, now we got our food uh, we're going to be doing the uh, Anthony Bourdain style. 
See if I can keep up with him. Anyway, this is the half chicken and uh, like some sort of uh, what, uh, what do they call it? Uh, it's like a Puerto Rican rice. It's a little bit spicy. One thing you realize is actually this place. It's South African, right? Yep. It's a it's a South African joint. Uh, really popular. It has a lot of review on it. As you guys, you know, if you've seen it, the name of the place. It's it's a lot of food right here, as you can see. That's a that's a, like a chicken uh, chicken breast. Some bread on side and some garlic bread. That's like that's some of their uh, one of their uh, favorite main dish that you can get. These guys are already hungry. Look at them already killing it. He has the half chicken. I have the half plate, meaning my plate is already half eaten. <laughs> and that's the guy that recommended that place for us, hey, man. Right there. This place to be at. You like chicken? <laughs> hey, where you need to come at, man? There you have it. So I'm about to kill this plate. Hopefully I can finish it. It's, it's quite a bit spendy, but really not that much. This whole thing costs like $20. So if you can afford $20, you might as well check it out. And if you like spicy food or spicy chicken, uh, a different type of spicy, they have all this, this different level of spiciness. So if you like whatever suits your, um, suits your mood, you can get it. There you have it. Man, this train is too loud. Chicago train is too loud. Anyway, uh, that food was just on point. It was incredibly good. I really, really enjoyed it. Highly, highly recommended uh, that place. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it a day. Thanks for tuning in. Stay tuned for more. Peace.